Well, it's been a tough few days. I guess I reached my limit. And I've just been hanging on in there for the last couple of days for sure. Both physically and emotionally drained. But over there in the distance, kind of on the, on the nose of the, where we're going, you may see some cranes on the skyline. They are the docks at Valencia. Currently, uh, somewhere between, I don't know, three and seven hours away depending on the winds and it's supposed to these winds are supposed to strengthen thank god yet more becalmed this morning really you know driving me mental absolutely mental but the wind's here now so we're dawdling along in exactly the right direction and very soon this epic idiocy will be over I may even just book myself in a hotel tonight <laughs> I think I will I deserve a night of, in, in a luxury hotel after this I got nothing clean to wear yeah well, we'll see. let's get there first before we make any other plans first thing I'm going to do once I've cleared all the the formalities of arriving is buy some cigarettes because frankly right now I would smoke I don't know what I'd smoke if you put it in front of me thank god for Django Reinhardt and Stefan Grappelli they've actually they've kept me sane all of the music that I've listened to these two have actually kept me sane everything else just I mean I've just been angry at everything for the last few days and yeah but these guys have just calmed me down, so that's nice. Anchorage to the south of the whole port and marina complex, and I guess that's where these guys are. So I've got to go around the outside of those, and then, uh, then we're almost there. What's the distance? I think it's about six miles to go. Seven. Seven point one. kind of getting a bit too dead down wind <laughs> but there you can see where I'm aiming for that's the marker on the end of the northern mole we've got to go around the outside of that and then uh, then we'll be engine on to get into the marina massive here we are six years later and we're still approaching the corner of the mole Seems like it. Am I getting a bit tetchy? Yes, I am. I'm surrounded by sea news <laughs> and all kinds of touristy, watery things. Oh, and lots of boats because we made it to Valencia. Grand total of 1,598, yes, 98 nautical miles, 15 days, no, 18 days and 5 hours. And let's have a look at it. Yeah, you see the red marks there? That's from the spinnaker sheets getting keel hauled down the boat a couple of times when I did the outside jibe and things went a bit ballistic uh, and then you pull it back up but as soon as it rubs against the anti-foul it picks up the red paint and then it uh, spreads it wherever it wants to go I don't know what the other marks down there are 
dirty dirty I'll have a look at that later there's the the bane of my life the friggin you can see it wafting about all of that movement there is why it doesn't work that's going to come off I think and she's sitting a little bit higher than she used to because I used all the fuel all of it used all of the water all of it and of course used all of the fags and the milk a long time ago there we go right I'm going to go and find a shower now these, I might pay these nice men to give her a clean, what do you think? <laughs> Don't look at me like that. They just sailed for 18 days. <laughs> oh, I need to... Oh, it works. Wonderful. So here we are in uh, La Marina, Valencia. This is actually like the water sports area and I won't be here for long. I'll be here just for a day or two I think and then they're gonna move me somewhere else. Let's get a look at the old girl on a mooring there. There you go. <laughs> she doesn't look out of place at all does she? wondering what happens to your hands 18 days wet and hauling ropes first your hands get blisters then the blisters get blisters and then the whole lot just sheds so uh, I think this is the second iteration first time I was a bit shocked second time ah, it's no biggie and I can already feel that uh, it's getting better again it's firming up funny thing is my iPhone doesn't recognize my fingerprints anymore so anyone wants to do like a heinous crime just go sailing single-handed for 18 days first and then you won't leave any fingerprints which is cool